it is time for some more vampire survivors hopefully the audio won't be completely messed up i did a test check ahead of time but who knows it could always change anyway vampire survivors beswick the new character colonel bahamut villain of hardcore hero of uprising or is he either way he is going to be going to the hectic highway get some operation gun on we're almost done now i did a little test and he does get the benefit of the beginning so let's punch some dudes all right fires explosive projectiles that travel along walls ah no he actually can't get the oh he can no sharp tongue for you bahamut only guns the guns are rare, so... Fires one more projectile. Cooldown reduced by half a second. Cooldown reduced by half a second. Base damage up 10. Base damage is not all that useful. <laughs> oh, that cough came out of nowhere. Base area up 50%. That's what I like to see. Oh yeah. And Ken Arbador, you shouldn't have. I once again forgot to check what he actually does as a character. Oh wow, so many cars. There's one more check out. Cool down just have another half a second. Oopsie. Hey, turn on this box already. Nice. Hey, there's my weapon power up. Just gotta remember not to take long gun. Just to make sure it doesn't occur on an accident. And hopefully this audio will not be terrible. I will also not lose at 17 minutes. And be incredibly frustrated and just do a hurry rush so I can actually get the video out. Instead, I do a ton of other giant problems. Because what else is new? I mean, it would help if I don't wake up five seconds before I have to go into work. Little clock, base area up again, base damage up again. There's a lot. A duplicator. Duplicator would be a good pick, though. I have to remember not to grab anything else. Man, where is Hollow Hurt? Oh man, they're firing out endlessly now. Wow, metal claw. He's going in hard. Sonic Bloom, Sonic Bloom, Super Sonic, Sonic Bloom. Oh hey, it carried around on the end. It started to loop around. It's driver mine on the left. Like, not only was the audio on the new video terrible, I think I could barely hear myself. I didn't even bother to record for the hyper one. Diver mind is with the track world, which I don't have, and I'm probably not gonna grab. I mean, I could have just paused it. I really need to edit the videos better. Perhaps I should hire some. Oh, dang it, bots. It's so hard to get the chests even when I know they're coming. Dang it. Well, not like I would have gotten anything. It would have actually been kind of dangerous. And I got three more slots. Spinach makes sense. Hollow hard course. Gotta make sure I focus on them big fuzzy fists. All right. First will be the. Hey, there you are, Hollow Heart. It took you long enough. Your Hollow Heart showed up after Torona's box and empty home. That's kind of crazy. Two more projectiles, eh?
Corona's box. Corona's box. The savior of a thousand and one runs. Corona's box. Wait, three minutes, not a boss. Four minutes, a boss. Oh, hey, I got the chest. Oh, is that why it reset? The startup? The patch actually came out? I should have checked the Discord. Alright, let's see how well you go out, fizzy fists. Oh, duplicator is also an option. That's why I want anything else. Oh, wow, it does, like, big crater punches, huh? Yeah, duplicator. So it fires out more. Right? It's kind of weird. I sometimes they're desynced and they double hit it. Sometimes they hit in sync. Hmm. Weird. Oh, I got another weapon power up. Huh. I didn't know that could happen. So I guess I can keep going as long as I don't fill up my passives. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, grenade. I mean, theory, if I just banish off every passive, I could probably get it infinite, right? Well, at least until I have one and don't have anything else to evolve. Wait, does it count as a weapon? Does it count as an active or a passive? Crud. It goes in the passive slot. Hmm. Well, you know what? I'll get... Wait, I can't evolve C laser. I'll test it out with max active weapons and see if it'll show up again. I have enough to evolve to keep going. Oh, I missed the chest entirely. I didn't even see that boss show up. Oh, is it looped already? Wow, it's a lot faster. I guess the patch did come through. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's audible on my tracker. So hopefully, it isn't on the actual video. But who knows? It'd be smart just to pause. I missed it again. Uh, you get distracted by a million things. Oh, here's to the next round. Alrighty, let's see if I can get another one, or if it's based on active weapons.
It is based on the past of Zell. Nice. Granted, I'm not sure if I can evolve another one. Good. I could evolve Fire Armor if I had it. I Man, I should still grab it. It gets me another revive. Well, I don't think I'm going to lose. I didn't think I was going to lose last time either. And then it happened. Go figure. Oh, I can pick up another one. Alright, what do I have? Okay, I can get Bracer, Tirajisu, Armor, or a Tractor. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna go grab Armor. Duplicator though. Duplicator. Man, so many gems are showing up at the top. Oh, short gun. You're too short. Too short to use. There we go. Yeah, I wonder if it counts as not moving here. Wait, are you maxed out? Sonic Bloom? Sonic Bloom. Sonic Bloom. Wait, it should turn yellow when you evolve it. Ponko, make it happen, Ponko. Armor. Oh, well, that was my level of storm. Okay, here it comes. Oh wait, it bottom. Yep, here we go. Let's see if it works when I'm standing still here. It does. But it's a. Uh... Wait. Hmm. I mean, it bounced on her hit when you have the Arcana. This is just infinite pierce. Huh. Interesting way to set that up. Hmm. Also, I suppose now learning this means that I could, in theory, mass evolve basically everyone. Right? There's three on the map, and then you can get six more. So, get nine out of twelve of them. Then, nine out of the eleven of them. Then you get the tenth with candy box, and the eleventh with super candy box. So could you do it? Okay, a long gun doesn't need it, so you only need ten. Things is on the map, so you need nine. Oops, shouldn't have grabbed that. Oh, no. Eleven weapons. You don't need it for a long gun, so that's ten. Wings is on the map, so it's nine. But you can only get six. So that's seven in total. Passives you get, so you need seven crates. So yeah, that should be doable. Oh, I need to go up a bit. I'm not getting all these gems. Oh no, they're just... I'm getting all the gems in the way. Because they're falling out from behind me. So I need to keep going that way. So things in front of me get taken care of. Okay, so 11 weapons. Uh, one of them gets taken out by candy box and the other is by wings. So it's nine, and then long guns, so you need eight pickups. So you need eight of the weapon cases. Or, well, I'm back myself up to Nightmare Stone here. Well, and also the Colonel seems very strong. Do you have health for Jen? 
And you get a health bar this big, it's kind of hard to tell if you have any gen. Alright. Uh, let's see. So you load up on the six guns. Okay, yeah, I think it might be doable to evolve nearly everything. It's not the weapon cases that are the problem, you know. Short gun, you get bracer. And spin gun, you get tome, yada. Double up. Sure won't have any might to do it that way, though. Oh, that's the chest. Well, that won't be helpful, or will it? Oh, I hope this catches it. Like, not only did it sound super tinny, but it wasn't just catching a lot of my very low, quiet voice. Yeah, there's a reason the audio is so jank. It's because I have to decibel it up so high to count the fact that I'm so dang quiet. And now I have three different ways to raise the volume. And they will all still fail miserably. I can get closer. Like that. Or I could turn up the gain. Or I could turn up the decibels on OBS. Or the D OBS the da on CapCut. Yep, that was totally the right thing I meant to say. Bang bang. That spot gun is doing work. Man, I missed having Lucky Tone. I wonder if that would have made Newt actually win on no. Newt lost because of Torona's box and getting stuck with all the big giant mobs spawning in, getting no room maneuver. And then them all being sucked in by the Atoma Torpedo, which would otherwise be an exceptionally strong evolution, except in this from the map. They could probably find out Jadora and for some serious nonsense. Man, I don't even know what enemies are spawning in. He thinks the weird flesh beasty things. This is weird. I wasn't expecting to go like this. Huh. No, no, I guess the sea laser explosion is doing a lot. Then the big fuzzy fists are doing big fisty fuzz things. Wait, why doesn't Big Fuzz actually use his own fists? I mean, I actually tried to let it survive for a bit to check out what it did. And I couldn't. Maybe it's something I could... Uh, I wonder if I would... No, the time freezes when you're in the boss fight, so you can't time it out. Unless something can be done. Yeah, it was a pretty long cold fever, considering I did no work for it at all. No, it times out... Well, the time stops advancing when you're in the big fuzz boss point. Probably trying to grab some of these. Oh. Well, just in case they were anything. I still haven't been hit, but my health is so large that I can't actually heal it up with 0.5 regeneration. So the barrier, so no nothing's getting in. I don't know though it's because of a big fuzzy fizz. Or something else. Like I know probably a requiem that is gonna be blowing things up if I see the laser. And you can definitely tell it's thicker. It's not very large still. But you can definitely see the effect that Candle Operador and Toronto's box have on it. Uh, oh, hey, that's what Conchetta's for. Get that, Google Illusions. And hopefully see some crazy stuff going on. I won't consider... Oh man, I'm just going to keep running into that. Well, I don't know. Hmm. Well, for the minis, for the combos, they do consider it as a passive slot, but the way the weapon box works is different. It can go over the limit just by default, as long as they're not maxed out. So, 
I will not count it for the rule of three. And that's my plan, and I'm sticking to it. That's, uh, well, sometime in June, probably. Um, yeah, I gotta go to Simon Santa Kyorutin. The actual third wave video that I recorded right before Operation Gun, which will be back to my old audio setup. Well, it'll probably sound better than this, I have no idea. Just to shell out the cash for enhanced cap cut like the corporate shill I am. Buy it, buy it, buy it. Give me money, cap cut. I want money. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Clickety clack. Click a tongue. When was the last time I bothered to move? Well, that's the Vampire Survivor's dream, isn't it? Not being able to move. Yeah, at least this time the mic's like... The length of a thumb, the index finger away. Last time it was the length of my arm. I have a longish arm, I think. But it was being caught on OBS's tracker. So I thought it was fine, but then it turned out to not be fine. But this is about as close as it is when I do the stream for Starship Troopers Extermination, and that sounds fine to me when I catch it on YouTube. But maybe that's YouTube somehow magically fixing it. Now they still haven't broken the barrier. Do I have that many? There's just nothing getting through. I guess nothing's just getting through. I wasn't expecting that. Easy 4K or easy 6K kills or takedowns. No, you stupid algorithm -y thing. How dare you? How dare you? You stop me from getting probably one more view or something. Well, either way, no matter what, thank you for watching. Thanks for the support for the channel. I know some, I mean, I do this a lot, is that I like, or I like, or I listen, or I enjoy something, but I don't really comment, or make it known, I don't know, shyness, laziness, nothing to say, they're all valid reasons, they're all reasons I've used. In fact, there was a video I wanted to make a comment on, and I still haven't commented on it. Or I did, and I completely forgot I did. Well, anyway, uh, back on to future notice. If there's anything you want to see in the third wave challenge, I got three weapons, three passes, and three arcanas for the characters that are, well, basically everything. It'll be in a bit. Like I said, mid June, probably, since I've got. Santa, Guru, Tin, Second Waves, and the Second Waves for all of them, so that's, well, 14 more, and it's going to be the 20th when this gets posted, so yeah, start of June is when the third wave goes back on. Oh, hey, Taka cleared through all of Muhammad's barriers. Not that it really mattered, but still, that's more impressive than anything else has been right now. Man, is Big Fuzzy Puss really that good? Bahamut's base stats that crazy. Oh, I moved. Yeah, he's got... Wow, so many levels. 307, jeez. Oh, wow, they're actually getting in. It's not gonna matter. I've got... What is it? Four eyes? Yeah, four of eyes. So that's another 1,200 health. And it's 1,800 health in total. And I'm just gonna get stronger and stronger. Oh, well, they're gonna get... Well, they also get stronger, they level up. That's what that uh, scaling HP means in the Ars Guda. Some mobs have 5 to like 40 or whatever, and the 40 is what they're like at the end. That doesn't matter, because... Well, short of like garlic, most of them aren't going to be that much durable anyway. Yeah, I can survive a hit. Like it's 
Let's buy more health. Most weapons are going to get more damage than that leveling up. So, peace out. Yeah, now I'm thinking about it. I should probably done, in the second wave, I probably should have done one run as the base weapon and then one as the evolve. Just to compare them. Like, you want to change some of them. But other ones get more, you know, they have different stats. Well, I mean, it's, I basically did that for like the Asunta and whatnot. And Cross was strangely better than Heaven's Sword. I guess the sheer amount, but whatever. Oh, that's death. Okay, let's see how the audio came out. 33.2 million with Wave Beam, huh. Maybe it's actually better not to get the bounce on that. No, oh, Big Fizzy Fist actually did less than Prototype C. Maybe everything was getting destroyed before the Fist could punch up. Oh, Diver Mines actually did pretty good for Not Evolved. Sonic Bloom did nothing. Comically nothing. Holy crap. Sea uh, Laser also did a ton. Well, that's Colonel Bahamut. Pretty easy. Greed and Curse increase my... Ah, I should have gone with Wicked Season. I did read that off last night. And time for Simondo Belmont. Simondo says he doesn't even need guns. Gets more projectiles every 20 levels. Well. Did... Do you need a whip, Simondo? I could get you a whip. Can I get rid of your max weapons? No. Well, it would seem that it is going to be a trying time for Simone de Belmont. Join me next time for more Vampire Survivors Beswick. Beating every stage with every character challenge. And why am I saying this before the outro thumbnail? Okay, and the Colonel takes us up to 244 on the Beswick. The audio seems actually okay, so that's nice and it won't drive me batty. And silent. Thanks for watching. Simondo clears up the final run of the Operation Guns DLC. No weapons. That's going to be a challenge for sure in the Operation Guns DLC. Thanks for watching the Vampire Survivors Beswick Challenge. We're at 162. So close, yet so far away. I appreciate everyone who's liked, disliked, commented, or subscribed. Your support keeps me going. And I hope you do do one of those things if you haven't already. Either way, have a good day and keep mezzing around.